Let's proceed to the next speaker. Ladies and gentlemen, and we are going back to soon as I'm welcoming the dynamic restaurant, Susan Agada from Abuja. Susan, it's her turn. And go to you. Thank you. Susan, it's her turn. Susan Agada is Good morning. expert from Abuja, Nigeria. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good morning, everybody. And it's a beautiful, it's a pleasure and an uh, opportunity to be here with you today. Can I confirm that you can all hear me? Uh, awesome, amazing. Um, I mean, this is a very beautiful event and it is very timely because as we all know, we are currently marking the 16 days of activism against gender-based violence. Um, I'll just say a bit about that. It's a campaign that runs from, it's an annual campaign that usually runs from the 25th of November um, to the 10th of December. And it is basically a campaign against eliminating all forms of violence and abuses against women and girls. And just speaking to my topic today, which is girls as an asset and a tool to ending gender-based violence. We cannot even overemphasize the importance of the girl child. Um, unfortunately, we're in a society, a patriarchal society, where we believe that uh, women and girls are supposed to be the subordinate gender group in the society. And, and as such, um, over time, we have realized that girls have not been prioritized and given the opportunity to maximize all their potentials. But thankfully, with development and with the knowledge and of the importance of gender equality, we are beginning to see a change in that trajectory. And just talking about girls and how important they are to, to the campaign against um, you know, gender-based violence, it means that as girls, we are very important. We are, we should um, have the ability to speak out. We should try and eliminate the culture of, of silence because that is a particular culture that has continued to promote the the very um, negative, um, you know, uh, very negative. Um, societal issue that we see around gender-based violence. We know that gender-based violence is hinged on power differences and power um, imbalance. And as such, unfortunately, girls are um, susceptible to a lot of issues of violence. Women and girls suffer a lot because of the power imbalance, because of the, um, the perceived subordinate gender um, you know, role that they hold in the society. I would like to use this opportunity to encourage our girl children to speak out, to be bold, to be assertive. In um, for, uh, Paradventure, you experience issues of abuses, issues of violence. It is important that you speak out and you do not encourage the culture of silence because the culture of silence over time has impacted negatively you know, on our girl children and have continued to promote this dangerous menace of gender-based violence. I want to appreciate all the young girls and even the young boys who are seated here to, today. I want to um, reiterate the fact that you are the future of tomorrow. And that means you are very important to the future of this country, Nigeria. I want to, uh, I want to encourage you to be assertive, to be focused, to be outspoken in all that you do. And as it pertains to issues of gender-based violence, do not, do not um, promote the culture of silence. When, there's, when you see something, say something. When you experience any form of abuse by anybody, please do not hesitate to speak out. Because by so doing, you can have all the support and the referral pathway can be activated for your, for your sake. So um, the uh, girl children, um, we are proud of you. We are proud of how well um, our female, a lot of speakers have spoken about um, very outstanding women from Nigeria, the Okonjo Iwelas, our Amina, our very own Amina in the United Nations, and so many women who are doing us proud out there. They all started as young girls like you, and we hope that as you continue to push forward in your studies and in your career, we, um, we, I want to encourage you 
to be very, very focused, very focused, ensure you, you study and um, keep focus. And even the boys, boys, there's no gender equality without uh, male engagement. Our boys are also as important as our girls. And I also want to encourage our boy children to work hand in hand with the girls because uh, by so doing, development is encouraged. So I wish us all a very great deliberation and most especially as um, this project continues to push for the girl child, we hope that you will get all of the support that you need to ensure that this good initiative that you are putting forward, that it can continue to grow and even create bigger and greater impact in the future to come. Um, so I'll end by saying, I wish you all a great session. And as we continue, as we round up the campaign to end gender-based violence, I want to leave you with the message of, if you see something, please say something. And let us continue to amplify our voices on ending the dangerous menace of gender-based violence in the society and continue to promote the girl child in our society. Thank you very much. And I wish us all a great deliberation. Thank you. Thank you.